Chapter 808 Wu Dong Qian Kun. This is the burning sky array? Atop the mountain peak, Ling Qingzu gazed at the flaming light array that had trapped Yuan Kang, as astonishment involuntarily flashed across her eyes. She had an extremely deep impression of the burning sky array within the burning sky ancient stash. She never imagined that Lin Dong would actually be able to summon it. Ling Qingzu had clearly recognized the burning sky cauldron. She had similarly witnessed the frightening strength of the scarlet-robed man when he used it to suppress the black fog creature. Although the current Lin Dong would definitely be unable to unleash the might of this treasure to the same extent as the scarlet-robed man, Yuan Kang's strength was also far from that black fog creature's. Lin Dong's techniques are truly endless. Even Yuan Kang has been forced into a somewhat miserable state by him. Wu Chun sighed from the side. There was a tinge of admiration in his voice. They were extremely clear about Yuan Kang's strength. However, not only did Lin Dong not fall into a disadvantageous position in the previous fight, he had even managed to trap Yuan Kang within the array. It was likely that no one present would be able to deny his ability. I've already said that Big Brother Lin Dong would not be afraid of Yuan Kang. Su Ru could not help but speak in a somewhat pleased manner. As her words faded, she quietly sighed in relief within her heart. Although she had always been confident in Lin Dong, she was clearly still a little worried in her heart. After all, no matter what, Lin Dong's opponent this time was Yuan Kang, the most outstanding person amongst the younger generation of the Eastern Zon region. Your confidence is somewhat reasonable. However, there's no need to celebrate so early. Do you really believe that Yuan Kang is easy to deal with? Even Chen Gui was defeated by him earlier. Although Lin Dong has many tricks up his sleeves, defeating Yuan Kang will not be an easy task. Wu Chun shook his head and said. Yes, Yuan Kang is not easy to deal with. I only have a 60% chance of victory against Chen Gui. However, Yuan Kang was able to defeat Chen Gui. Clearly, he has some hidden trump cards. It is still too early to say who will emerge victorious in their fight. Ling Qingzu gently nodded and said. Originally, Su Ru wanted to refute Wu Quan's words. However, after hearing Ling Qingzu's words, she could only nod her head. After being silent for a while, she once again said, However, I still believe that Big Brother Lin Dong will win. Wu Chun was speechless. He could not understand why Su Ru would treat Lin Dong as an invincible war god. Ling Qingzu's veil trembled slightly upon hearing this. She appeared to be smiling softly. After which, her eyes looked towards the fire light array in the distant sky. She really wanted to see just who would have the last laugh in this intense battle. Boom! Yuan Kang's expression was a little dark and solemn as he stood within the flaming light array that filled the sky. With a jerk of the metal sword in his hand, a swift and fierce sword aura smashed against the flaming light barrier. However, it only caused ripples to surface on the light barrier, and did not show any signs of breaking it. Clearly, this burning sky array was indeed somewhat extraordinary, and was actually able to trap him within it. With your strength, even with the burning sky cauldron in your hands, how much of its power can you activate? Yuan Kang calmed his heart after a series of futile attacks. His eyes were ice cold as he looked at Lin Dong in the distance, and sneered and ridiculed. From some ancient books, Yuan Kang knew that old man Fen Tian had relied on the burning sky cauldron to kill many experts during the ancient times. However, it was obvious that the current Lin Dong was far from reaching that level. It's enough to deal with you. Lin Dong smiled faintly towards Yuan Kang. Soon after, he did not have any intention to continue speaking nonsense with the latter. His hand seal changed, and the burning sky cauldron hovering in the sky turned upside down. The cauldron cover fell off and started to rotate at high speed. Extremely berserk and scorching scarlet red light crazily gathered at the mouth of the cauldron. Clearly, it was brewing an extremely powerful attack. Since you're so confident, I'll break this array for you. Let's see what else you can do after that. Yuan Kang's eyes involuntarily turned dark and cold upon seeing the scene. His body faintly jerked, as boundless and mighty Yuan power suddenly whizzed out from within his body. After which, two of his fingers curled together, and pointed towards the air. Yuan God Codex, Yuan God Sword Finger. A low and deep roar suddenly resounded in the sky as Yuan Kang pointed his fingers forward. In the next moment, 
everyone saw a bright and resplendent light suddenly gather at the tip of Yuan Kang's fingers, and rapidly transformed into an extremely large light sword. Finally, his eyes were ice cold. Under the command of his fingers, the light sword contained an extremely frightening destructive force, as it ruthlessly hacked towards the fire light barrier. Humph. Upon seeing this, Lin Dong let out a cold roar. Soon after, both of his feet took mysterious steps in the air. Boundless Yuan power spread out, as an enormous light figure took shape behind him. When this light figure took shape, battle intent that blotted the skies swept out like a storm, causing one's expression to change. Martial Emperor Codex, Shattering Fist Lin Dong's mysterious footwork suddenly froze. Soon after, a fist rumbled out with a grave expression on his face. The light figure behind him also abruptly punched out. In the next moment, a giant fist that seemed to be formed from battle intent that blotted the skies directly whizzed down from the sky. It charged into the light array, and collided with the light sword. Bang! Wild and violent energy fluctuations swept out, causing ripples to appear on the light barrier. However, it was ultimately unable to break it. Martial Emperor Codex? Within the light array, shock was revealed in Yuan Kang's eyes as he looked at the light figure behind Lin Dong, which was filled with battle intent that blotted the skies. Disbelief was present in his eyes. There were quite a number of ancient stashes in Unique Devil region. However, there weren't many that were extremely famous. The Burning Sky Ancient Stash was one of them, while the other was the so-called Martial Emperor Ancient Stash. It was rumored that the ancient martial emperor had painstakingly created a martial art within the ancient martial emperor's ancient stash, the Martial Emperor Codex. This martial art was only stronger than the three great divine codex of their Yuan Gate. Hence, he was so shocked when he saw that this martial art had actually appeared in Lin Dong's hands. That bastard. At this moment, even with Yuan Kang's character, he could not help but curse out in his heart. Why was this fellow's luck so good? Not only had the burning sky cauldron landed in his hands, even the Martial Emperor Codex, which no one had ever seen before, had become his. Lin Dong looked at the ugly expression on Yuan Kang's face, as a sneer rose from the corners of his mouth. He had just obtained the Martial Emperor Codex. However, his martial art talent clearly far surpassed the Yang brothers. Therefore, although he was still unable to use it to the point of perfection like the Green Heaven materialized dragon skill, he was already countless times better than the Yang brothers. Moreover, even though he had only just started learning it, the tyrannical might of this martial art was already starting to show. It was likely that it would become a powerful killing move for him in the future. Now, have a good taste of the might of this burning sky array. Lin Dong raised his gaze, and saw that the indescribably berserk and scorching scarlet red light at the mouth of the burning sky cauldron had already condensed to the limit. The frighteningly high temperature directly caused the surrounding space to distort. Burning sky cauldron, eight desolated flames. Lin Dong's eyes were cold and stern. His hand seals changed, before suddenly pointing towards Yuan Kang, who was within the array. In the next instant, the burning sky cauldron faintly trembled, as buzzing noises continuously rang out. Bang! The trembling of the burning sky cauldron did not continue for long. In the next instant, scarlet red light that blotted the skies abruptly howled out from the mouth of the cauldron like a volcanic eruption. Like a river of magma, it explosively shot towards Yuan Kang, who was within the burning sky array. Bang bang! The scarlet red river caused space to completely distort as it passed. The frightening fluctuations caused the expressions of countless people to change. Lei Qian and Ling Zhen, who were on the Yuan gate side, had shock and horror appearing within their eyes. The fluctuations caused them to understand that if they were the ones trapped within the array, not even ashes would be left. Bang bang! The scarlet red river that was akin to magma violently shot into the burning sky array. At this moment, the light array rapidly flickered, causing the high temperature to become increasingly frightening, while Yuan Kang's figure was rapidly enveloped within it. Condense. Upon seeing this scene, Lin Dong suddenly clenched his hand, only to see the scarlet red energy that filled the light array rapidly turn ice cold. In the next instant, like magma cooling down, it directly transformed into a thousand feet large magma rock, suppressing Yuan Kang within it. We've won. 
Upon seeing this scene, wild and joyous cheers immediately rang out from the Dao sect disciples. Pang Tong and the rest were so excited that their bodies trembled. Ying Xiaoxiao and the rest looked at each other. Although they were not overly ecstatic, there was clearly a joy that was difficult to hide in their eyes. It's been dealt with? The mountain peak was completely silent. Wu Chun was stunned as he looked at the sky, while his eyes were filled with disbelief. Ling Qingzu's eyebrows faintly knitted together, as her eyes stared intently at the gigantic mountain rock. In the next instant, her pupils abruptly shrunk, as she slowly shook her head, not yet. Truly troublesome. At the same time, Lin Dong, who was hovering in the sky, muttered. As his voice faded, numerous tiny cracks suddenly extended from the depths of the mountain rock. In the next instant, a dazzling light violently shot out from within. The entire mountain rock exploded at this moment, causing rock fragments to fill the sky. Lin Dong's body pulled back. With a beckon of his hand, the burning sky cauldron landed beneath his feet. Soon after, his eyes sunk slightly as he looked at the dazzling light. At that spot, a figure in tattered clothes was slowly walking out, while accompanied by monstrous killing intent. Lin Dong, you are the first amongst the younger generation of the Eastern Zon region to be able to force me to such an extent. A voice that was filled with incomparably sinister killing intent spread across the sky. Everyone's gazes looked over, and saw the figure that had walked out from the sky. It was Yuan Kang. Lin Dong's gaze also looked towards Yuan Kang at this moment. In the next instant, his gaze paused on the latter's forehead. At that spot, a mysterious symbol was currently flickering with a dazzling light. The symbol that had appeared this time was undoubtedly even clearer than when he had exchanged blows with Chen Gui. Hence, it was immediately discovered by many people the moment it appeared, as shocked voices rang out one after another. Spirit emblem? Huff. Lin Dong exhaled a deep breath of air. His eyes had become completely grave. It was unexpected that Yuan Kang also possessed such a powerful trump card. Chapter 809 Wu Dong Qian Kun Lin Dong was clearly not unfamiliar with the spirit emblem. Back when he participated in the Hundred Empire War, Su Ru had obtained this thing. A few days ago, Ling Qingzu had also obtained a spirit emblem from the bottom of the Supreme Purity Celestial Pond. With regards to this item, even someone like Lin Dong coveted it. Only those extremely powerful practitioners could condense a spirit emblem after their death. Within it was the condensation of a great amount of energy from when they were alive. Therefore, it could be considered as an extremely unique natural treasure. However, this kind of treasure required a human as the most basic ingredient. The spirit emblem did not possess any intelligence. Normally speaking, it would rely on its instincts to search for the person with the highest compatibility with it. For example, at the bottom of the Supreme Purity Celestial Pond, the spirit emblem had searched for Ling Qingzu and not Lin Dong. This caused the latter to feel exceptionally helpless. Although he might be able to snatch it by force, it would ultimately be difficult to obtain the most perfect result. Although the owner of the spirit emblem could not compare to a reincarnator, the advantage of it was that there were quite a lot of them. After all, even during the ancient times, reincarnation stage experts were quite rare. Over the years, Lin Dong only knew of one reincarnator, and that was Ying Wan Wan. However, the spirit emblem was much more numerous. Of course, one would need to be extremely lucky to obtain one. At the very least, Lin Dong, who had coveted this thing for a long time, had never obtained one. The spirit emblem contained an extremely vast and pure energy. This energy would gradually and completely merge into the body of the owner as his or her strength increased. Moreover, the cultivation speed of the owner of the spirit emblem would be much faster than an ordinary person. Additionally, at some critical junctures, one would be able to activate the power of the spirit emblem to temporarily increase one's strength in order to defend against powerful enemies and survive dangerous situations. It was rumored that in some of the larger regions outside of the Eastern Zon region, there were even some spirit emblems being auctioned in some extremely large-scale auctions. However, the price one had to pay in order to obtain it would likely be quite terrifying. From this, one could see that the spirit emblem was also quite rare. Therefore, Lin Dong was so shocked when he saw the spirit emblem on Yuan Kang's forehead. I never imagined that Yuan Kang would actually possess a spirit emblem. On the mountain peak, 
Wu Quan's face was filled with envy as he gazed at the sky. Soon after, he glanced at Su Ru beside him. He had quite a high status amongst the Nine Heavens Supreme Purity Palace disciples. Therefore, he was able to obtain some information, such as the fact that Su Ru also possessed a spirit emblem. No wonder this fellow was able to become the leader amongst the younger generation in the Eastern Zon region. It turns out that he had obtained the help of a spirit emblem. Su Ru's little face was a little ugly as she angrily said. As a fellow possessor of a spirit emblem, she clearly knew how beneficial it was to practitioners. Moreover, from the looks of it, Yuan Kang had clearly activated the power of the spirit emblem. Therefore, Lin Dong would undoubtedly be in some trouble. Wu Chun looked at the furious Su Ru, and could not help but feel somewhat helpless. He really wanted to remind her that she also had that thing in her body. There was no such thing as absolute fairness in this world. At times, being able to obtain a spirit emblem was also a form of one's own strength. However, it seems that Lin Dong is in some danger now. Wu Chun raised his head and looked at the young figure standing on the scarlet red cauldron in the distance. There was some admiration in his eyes. Regardless of the outcome of this battle, Lin Dong's reputation would definitely soar in the Eastern Zon region. Relying on his 8 Yuan Nirvana stage strength, he was able to force Yuan Kang, who was at the initial profound life stage, to activate a spirit emblem. This ability was already quite shocking. Beside him, an extremely faint worry flashed across Ling Qingzu's clear eyes. Although Lin Dong had many tricks up his sleeves, there was still a huge gap between him and Yuan Kang. If not for the Great Desolation Scripture absorbing the life force energy within a radius of several dozen miles, it was likely that he would not be able to fight with Yuan Kang to such an extent. Now that Yuan Kang had unleashed his final trump card and activated his spirit emblem, his strength had soared once again. Lin Dong's situation was clearly a little worrying. The entire place was clearly a little stirred because of Yuan Kang's spirit emblem. In the direction of the Tao sect, the joy on the faces of Ying Xiaoxiao and the rest had completely disappeared, replaced by thick anxiety. The change in the situation was really a little too quick. In the end, he was still forced to completely use it. Ling Zhen looked at the sky. Soon after, he smiled faintly and said, Looks like the battle is about to end. Previously, even Chen Gui was only able to force Boss to use a little of the Spirit Emblem's strength. Now that the Spirit Emblem's strength has been fully unleashed, Lin Dong will definitely die. Lei Qian laughed sinisterly. Once Lin Dong is finished off later, the Tao sect will definitely be utterly defeated. I have not killed to my heart's content earlier. Coincidentally, there is a reason for everything I do here. This time around, I will kill a little more. I will kill until the Tao sect disciples piss their pants in terror when they see my Yuan Gate disciples in the future. Lei Qian laughed heartily. His laughter was filled with an eccentric killing intent. Upon hearing this, the surrounding Yuan Gate disciples' eyes flickered with ominous glints. Soon after, they smiled sinisterly and nodded. Spirit Emblem Ha, huh? truly unexpected. In the sky, Lin Dong finally inhaled a deep breath of air. He looked at Yuan Kang, who had a flickering symbol between his brows, and said. Tell me, how should I kill you? Yuan Kang patted his somewhat tattered clothes. His current appearance was a little miserable. This also caused the murderous intent in his eyes to swiftly gather. Soon after, he stared at Lin Dong and smiled. His smile was filled with a sinister aura that could not be hidden. A chill flashed across Lin Dong's eyes upon hearing this. However, before he could speak, his pupils shrunk slightly as his body pulled back explosively. Swoosh! The space in front of him distorted while he was pulling back explosively. A phantom-like figure had already rushed over. The metal sword in his hand was accompanied by an extremely sharp sword aura as it pierced towards Lin Dong's throat at lightning speed. Yuan Kang's speed was even faster than before. Lin Dong was already unable to dodge the sword as it hacked down. Immediately, he crossed his arms and protected his throat. Kai! The metal sword hacked onto Lin Dong's arm. However, no sparks appeared this time around. Instead, a bloody scar directly appeared on Lin Dong's arm. Soon after, fresh blood flowed down. Clearly, Yuan Kang's strength had once again soared after activating the spirit seal. That sharp attack was actually able to break Lin Dong's powerful defenses. Lin Dong borrowed the momentum to retreat explosively. Soon after, 
he glanced at the sword scar on his arm. Although it was a little painful, it was not a big deal. It was likely that if it was not because his green heaven materialized dragon skill had improved once again, it was likely that Yuan Kang's sword would have crippled one of his hands. Let me see how many of my swords you can block. Yuan Kang's finger rubbed the blood on the sword. Soon after, he raised his head and revealed a ferocious smile towards Lin Dong. In the next moment, his eyes suddenly turned sinisterly cold. His body turned into an afterimage as he rushed forward. Lin Dong's body shook. Green dragon wings extended from his back, after which, his speed soared as he swiftly pulled back. Swoosh! Lin Dong's body had just pulled back when a hundred feet large sword glow hacked at the spot where he had previously landed. Soon after, Yuan Kang's body appeared. His attacks once again enveloped Lin Dong from all directions. In the sky, one was chasing while the other was fleeing. Faced with Yuan Kang, whose strength had soared after activating the spirit seal, it was obvious that even the current Lin Dong would find it extremely difficult to deal with him. For a time, Yuan Kang had undoubtedly occupied the upper hand in the battle. The Yuan Gate disciples also roared with laughter at this moment. Some of them even made various mocking actions towards Dao sect, causing the faces of many Dao sect disciples to turn red with anger. Does he intend to continue fleeing like this? Wu Chun gazed at the sky, and could not help but laugh bitterly. Lin Dong's speed was indeed not weak. If he had the intention to evade, even the current Yuan Kang would have difficulty killing him. However, could he continue fleeing like this? Ling Qingzu knitted her eyebrows slightly. Her eyes stared intently at the figure that was continuously retreating under Yuan Kang's pursuit. Her eyes suddenly hardened, after which, she shook her head and softly said, He seems to be preparing something. Oh? Wu Chun was startled. Soon after, he spoke with a voice filled with doubt. Do you think that he still has some tricks up his sleeves? Even if he does, can he defeat Yuan Kang, who possesses a spirit seal? Quote. Ling Qingzu gently bit her lips. She was similarly uncertain about the answer to this question. However, based on her understanding of Lin Dong, it was likely that this fellow would not speak without thinking. Since he had taken action, it meant that he really did have some tricks up his sleeves. However, she was not too certain whether these tricks would be effective. Do you only know how to continue hiding like this? What happened to that mighty aura from before? In the sky, Yuan Kang's expression involuntarily became dark and solemn after having once again struck empty air. He laughed coldly and ridiculed. However, Lin Dong completely ignored Yuan Kang's ridicule. His hand, which was hidden in his sleeve, trembled slightly. You can hide but I want to see where these Dao sect disciples can hide. A densely cold expression suddenly flashed across Yuan Kang's eyes. His body turned and swung his arm downwards. A hundred feet large sharp sword aura suddenly changed direction and swept towards the Dao sect disciples below. With his current strength, it was obvious that no Dao sect disciple could block this attack. Hence, the expressions of the Dao sect disciples involuntarily changed drastically when they saw this. Ying Xiaoxiao's expression was also a little ugly. Soon after, she clenched her teeth and tried to forcefully block it. However, a skinny figure had already appeared in the sky just as she was about to act. After which, he directly used his body to receive the sword. Kai. A foot-long bloody wound appeared on Lin Dong's shoulder and extended all the way to his abdomen. Fresh blood flowed down, causing him to appear exceptionally miserable. Senior brother Lin Dong. The expressions of the Dao sect disciples below changed drastically upon seeing this. Everyone's fists were tightly clenched, while their eyes turned scarlet red. How bold! Yuan Kang watched this scene with ridicule. Soon after, he spoke in a sinister voice, Can you still run now? There is no need to run. Lin Dong suddenly twisted his body in front of Yuan Kang's sinister eyes. He glanced indifferently at the wounds on his body. After which, he lifted his head and looked at Yuan Kang. His mouth parted into a smile. His smile was filled with ferocity and brutality. This is because the one who should run next is you. Lin Dong laughed in a sinister manner. After which, he extended both of his hands. An extremely mysterious light array surfaced on his palm. After which, he bit the tip of his tongue and spat out a mouthful of essence blood. It landed on the light array, and the light array swelled with the wind. Within a short few breaths, 
it had transformed into a thousand feet large array that covered the sky and land. A ripple that caused one's soul to palpitate slowly spread. The enormous array covered the sky, while Lin Dong's face completely paled. He lifted his head. His eyes contained a scarlet red luster as he stared ferociously at Yuan Kang. Soon after, an icy cold and emotionless voice resounded. I have said that I will make everyone in Yuan Gate accompany those Dao sect brothers who have died. Chapter 810 Wu Dong Qian Kun An enormous formation spread out in the sky. Countless mysterious light rays spread out from within, intertwining with each other, giving off an obscure and ancient feeling. This formation was undoubtedly even more complicated than the burning sky array from before. Moreover, the various minute fluctuations that were emitted from it caused quite a number of people to feel a heartfelt palpitations. This formation was naturally the ancient universe formation. However, the scale of the ancient formation this time around was clearly the most terrifying one that Lin Dong had ever activated. What formation is this? Wu Quan's eyes contained a faint shock as he looked at the formation that enveloped the sky. Although the formation had yet to be completely activated, he could already feel a heart palpitating danger. How can this fellow form a formation at any time? How is it possible for him to condense such a complicated formation by himself? Quote. Ling Qingzu's eyes locked onto the pale-faced young man in the distant sky. She clenched her jade-like hand and softly said, he should possess the original form of this formation. Therefore, there is no need for him to form it. As long as he has enough Yuan power, he will be able to activate it. However, the Yuan power consumption of this formation is quite frightening. Ling Qingzu muttered. She could sense Lin Dong's rapidly weakening aura. Clearly, even though he had used the Great Desolation Scripture to absorb the life force energy within a radius of several dozen miles, it was still a little too much for him to form such an enormous formation. What is that thing? The expressions of Ling Zhen, Lei Qian and the rest also changed when they saw the enormous formation that had appeared in the sky. The complexity of the formation in front of them far exceeded that of the burning sky array from before. Even with their eyesight, they were unable to identify just what kind of formation it was. Although Lin Dong had used the ancient universe formation before, the scale was not even a tenth of the current one. Therefore, Ling Zhen and the rest were unable to identify it. This brat is really troublesome to deal with. Ling Zhen clenched his teeth. For some unknown reason, he vaguely felt a little uneasy in his heart. Gather everyone together. Ling Zhen's eyes flickered before he spoke in a deep voice. Why? Lei Qian frowned and asked. I keep feeling that something is amiss. The uneasiness in Ling Zhen's eyes had become much denser. The formation in the sky caused him to feel as though he was sitting on pins and needles. Do you really think that brat has the ability to make all the disciples of my Yuan Gate accompany those trash from Dao sect? Lei Qian frowned tightly. However, he hesitated for a moment when he saw Ling Zhen's grave expression. After which, he waved his hand, and the surrounding Yuan Gate disciples swiftly gathered towards him. Upon seeing this, Ling Zhen finally sighed in relief in his heart. Immediately, his eyes turned dark and stern as he looked towards the sky and muttered, I want to see just what kind of tricks you can play. You really have a lot of tricks up your sleeve. In the sky, Yuan Kang raised his head and looked at the enormous array that was spreading out. Soon after, he slowly lowered his head. His eyes were dark and cold as they locked onto Lin Dong as he spoke in a gloomy voice. But if you want to use this thing to deal with me, I'm afraid you're still dreaming. Yuan Kang's eyes were dark and stern as he took a step forward. The spirit seal between his brows flickered rapidly. In the next instant, an extremely majestic fluctuation suddenly swept out from within his body. This fluctuation had already reached the peak of the initial profound life stage. I will let you see just how laughable the trump card you are so proud of is in my eyes. Monstrous Yuan power whizzed out from within Yuan Kang's body like floodwaters. Finally, it transformed into a thousand feet large Yuan power figure behind him. An extremely powerful pressure radiated from the Yuan power figure. Yuan God Codex, Yuan God Body. A low and deep icy cold cry was suddenly emitted from Yuan Kang's mouth. Immediately, two of his fingers formed a sword seal and suddenly hacked forward. Bang! The moment Yuan Kang's sword fingers hacked forward, 
The Yuan power giant figure behind him also lifted its huge hand. A frightening fluctuation that seemed to penetrate through the sky suddenly shot out. Finally, it was accompanied by an extremely frightening destructive force as it ruthlessly hacked towards the enormous array in the sky. Bang bang bang. Wave after wave of frightening fluctuations wildly swept out. The invisible air was completely blasted apart at this moment. Continuous rumbling sounds appeared in the sky. Everyone could feel the might of Yuan Kang's attack. Some of the remnant ripples that were emitted from the Yuan power pillar caused the scalps of some peak nine Yuan Nirvana stage experts to turn numb. Lin Dong watched this scene as iciness gathered within his eyes. Soon after, his hand seals suddenly changed and the formation in the sky immediately began to operate. Oh, why is the formation operating in the reverse direction? Has Lin Dong been beaten silly? Quote. Quite a number of sharp-eyed individuals were able to detect some clues the moment the formation moved. Immediately, quite a number of astonished voices sounded out. However, Lin Dong ignored the many voices that resounded across the sky. As the formation rotated in the reverse direction, one could see an extremely strange light beam rapidly gathering at the middle of the formation. Swoosh. When the beam of light took shape, it was merely a foot wide and did not emit any majestic undulations. However, when Lin Dong saw it, the corners of his mouth lifted into an arc. Soon after, his finger pointed out in the air, as the beam of light suddenly whizzed downwards. Under the countless watching gazes, it directly collided with the giant Yuan power figure with a loud bang. Sizzle sizzle. When the two collided, there was no expected loud sound, nor was there any so-called stalemate. Wherever the light beam passed, the majestic Yuan power that pervaded the giant Yuan power shadow strangely dissipated at an astonishing speed. The light beam swept across the sky, after which, everyone was stunned to see that the giant Yuan power figure was actually directly penetrated. From the looks of it, it seemed as though it was unable to block the light beam. What? Yuan Kang's expression finally changed at this moment. He could sense that wherever the light beam passed, even the natural Yuan power would be disintegrated into nothingness. What exactly is this thing? Panic finally surged in Yuan Kang's heart at this moment. Soon after, his body suddenly retreated and dodged the light beam that was shooting over. Swoosh! The light beam swept past Yuan Kang, after which, it shot towards a Yuan Gate disciple below with lightning-like speed. Kai! The light beam swept down. Soon after, everyone saw that the Yuan Gate disciple's entire body had strangely disappeared when the light beam shot down. From the looks of it, not even a single piece of flesh was left. Rumble. An empty space immediately appeared around that disciple. All the Yuan Gate disciples had horrified expressions on their faces as they watched this scene. A terrifying chill faintly surged from their hearts. As he watched the fear on the faces of those Yuan Gate disciples, a bloodthirsty smile faintly appeared on Lin Dong's pale young face. Traces of brutality crazily climbed out from the depths of his eyes. Lin Dong, you are courting death. Yuan Kang's pupils shrunk. As he looked at Lin Dong's face, a chill surged from deep within his heart. Immediately, he cried out in a dark and gloomy voice. Lin Dong seemed to smile when he heard this. After which, he suddenly slammed his palm on his chest. With a, grug, sound, a mouthful of essence blood was spat out from his mouth. Finally, it completely rushed into the great formation in the sky. As Lin Dong's essence blood poured in, a light curtain began to pour down from the ancient universe formation. Finally, it directly wrapped around all the Yuan Gate disciples, including Yuan Kang. Lin Dong, what are you trying to do? Are you trying to start a war between Yuan Gate and Dao Sect? Upon seeing this, Ling Jen's expression changed drastically as he cried out explosively. In this place, we are allowed to do anything. Didn't all of you think so too? In the face of Ling Jen's explosive cry, a smile surfaced on Lin Dong's extremely pale face. However, this smile caused the Yuan Gate disciples to tremble with fear when they saw it. I have said that I will make all of you accompany me in death. In the sky, Lin Dong looked down at the Yuan Gate disciples from above. His hand wiped off the blood at the corner of his mouth. His somewhat gentle and weak voice reverberated across the sky, causing everyone's scalp to turn numb. They looked at Lin Dong's smiling pale face. 
Only then did they truly understand that Lin Dong actually intended to kill all the Yuan Gate disciples. This fellow is a lunatic. A chill rose from the bottom of everyone's feet. Finally, it rushed to the top of their heads. Wasn't this fellow a little too ruthless? To be continued.